Good morning. Good morning. All right, all right. I see a lot of us out here today. Uh, my name is DeAndre Jones. I am the Vados State University president of the uh, NAACP. Right. Also, uh, I hold a unique position uh, with the state and the ACP. Uh, I am actually the Southwest District Coordinator uh, for Georgia, Southwest Georgia District Coordinator for the NAACP Youth and College Division. So that means I have a pretty unique site on this whole South Georgia area. And when I was briefed on uh, this consolidation uh, earlier this year uh, by Lee Touchton in the AACP up by the Lounge, I thought about it. I said, I've been here before. I'm from America's Georgia. I, we, they consolidate our schools in America, Georgia. I, w I was actually a member of that first class who went through the first four years of America something kind of high school. So I know what consolidation, I've been through that. I've seen the community go through that. But it, and about also, this is a unique situation. This, this, isn't, uh, this is different from America, Georgia. Uh, we're talking about you all's education here. And I want, first of all, I want to give the kids, y'all give these kids a round of applause for their school. I told my general membership Thursday that I was going to be here, uh, and I said, you know what, somebody marched for my education, and I, I don't have a problem with marching for these kids' education today. Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. and, and there's another thing. When you're talking about academics, I'm going to go back to academics because I'm glad uh, you brought it up. This is important. This is very important because I don't know all the facts. I'm going to be honest. I don't know all the facts, but I know when any time when there's an organized effort to do something that the city doesn't want, the then we have a problem in the county. You're right. In the county, there's a problem. This wasn't a racial issue. This is not, you know, this is bigger than that. This is bigger than that. So when they called on me to come out here, I said I have to speak. I have to speak for the youth because th this is y'all's moment. This is your moment to show up on those polls at November on November 8 and vote no. Am I right? Yeah. What we gonna vote? No. What we gonna vote? No. What we gonna vote? No. All right. Now, now, once again. This is very important that you show up to these polls. We can march all day and we can pray all night, but until we show up to those polls on November 8th and we vote, and we vote, what we gonna vote? No! What are we gonna vote? No! No! Okay, this is your city, this is your town, this is your county. Don't let people come in here and persuade you with uh, Morgan Freeman sound lights on the radio. Don't, don't let the legacy of MLK be distorted right. in this community. Right. Don't let them use race to divide us. Yeah. Yeah. I see black and white people out here today. Am I wrong? I'm going to tell you why I'm passionate about this. I'm going to tell you why I'm passionate about it. Because this is a civil rights issue. This is a civil rights issue. Mainly because this is about education. And once again, like I said, when you have organized efforts to force a city to do something, any county to do something they don't want to do, that they're not comfortable with doing, there's no plan. I have yet to see a plan for QE about the education or the academics. What will happen to uh, programs like Becca that were established? What will happen when they consolidate this, uh, these schools? What will happen to programs like Becca? What will happen to our teachers? What will happen to you all's taxes? So until I see a plan, I'm not convinced. Right. Not right now, I'm not convinced. Right. So, you. most importantly, this vote on November 8th is about you all's charter, am I right? Right. right? So, you make sure you show up to those polls. And kids, I know y'all can't vote if you're under 18, I know you can't vote, they but can. you all need to push your parents, remind them. Right. Remind them. Say, Mom, Dad, Uncle, Grandma, <laughs> Auntie, Pastor, yeah. Yeah. Teacher, yeah. Pastor, right. Pastor, Pastor. Show up to those folks, because we need you. We need you parents, we need you teachers, we need you community. And, I, and I, I'm, I'm very glad I was invited here today. But I'm not going to speak too long. I'm not going to speak too long, not at all. But I definitely just want to motivate you all to take back your city. Take back your city. Take back your city. Y'all want to hear before I sit down. What are we going to vote? No! What are we going to vote? No! What are we going to vote? No! Thank you. Thank you.